We just broke our fast and uh, we pray in Maghrib and now it's time to get some real food. Let's go. There's one place which I always wanted to try. It's called Orient Express and they have Padang style food. Let's check it out. Let's go. Thank you so much. That's sambal? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one. Mm. I don't know which one I like more. Um, the spring roll or the chili sauce. Both are nice and together even better. What's wow. That? A long tong? Long tong, yeah. Oh, nice uh, big uh, plate. This is vegetable long tong, so that's why we have veggies. We have a uh, rice cake and the krupuk and some uh, soup, maybe coconut milk, curry, small. Wow. 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 This is so rich um, flavor. I taste the coconut milk. There's some spiciness. Oh, let's try the group of. Good crunch. Really strong shrimp flavor. Mm. Does my hungry camera woman want to try the long okay. Surprise? Let me check you. Yeah. You and your wife are running this business, yeah? yeah? yeah, yeah. No, I fell in love with the food. I was like, look, every year we go to Indonesia just to eat food. Yes. Why don't we just I, do one here in London? I think a lot of people don't are not aware of the Indonesian dishes. Mm. Our menu is very limited, so we try to pick out all like the favourites. Our chef who's been cooking for the last 20 years and we probably just catch him there he's just taking a small break yeah hello Apa kabar? it's all authentic food here um, and we try to make sure that our food is value for money our prices are probably the most competitive prices here in london because we don't want people to be afraid to come and try our food i want everyone to come try the food and just see for yourself you're a big fan of indonesian food your favorite my favorite have a guess. Rendang, rendang. Nothing beats the rendang for me. For me, it's uh, quite similar. Yeah, nothing beats. And my wife never understood why I like the rendang so much. The beef is cut in uh, thin slices. It doesn't smell too spicy. I smell. I think that's a bulla version. I would need to add maybe a little bit of this sambal to make it more spicy. Chili rice and beef this should be better combination mm. it's quite a unique taste i never had this dish before nasi dendeng so that's something new for me but i think my favorite is uh, this uh, long tongue that's our channel. Yes. Thank you. Indonesian food review would be not complete if we didn't order chendol. All I did in Indonesia was drink coconut water was like my natural supply of water. You uh, mix it with the syrup or not? No, of course not. It no. ruins it, isn't it? Yeah. Don't mix it. Give me that from yeah. the coconut, you know? Yeah. They put like wine. I'm like, no, because this is how I want it. I think it's some shredded coconut. I couldn't need a knife, but you know, like Indonesians are not really keen on using knife. This one. Mm. 
Yeah, that's some shredded coconut. I think there's a little bit pandan. Please uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but it's sweet. It's uh, hot and cold at the same time. Mm. Really nice dessert. Tonjo. I think Indonesians love green stuff. Most of the desserts in Indonesia are green. Yeah, long tongue, and this dessert was my favorite this time. The chandals is always nice. The dendeng was uh, good too. Can't complain, no. This is jumbo? I think so. Maybe that's a bully portion because we eat more than Asians or we have a little bit more space in our stomach. <laughs> well, what are you doing now? I'm eating with my hand. The Indonesian way. So I start to pack it. Okay, it's about 5 pounds. It's about I'm happy we came today to Orient Express. Uh, the food was nice. This time we didn't order that much because you know when you're fasting your stomach shrinks and I'm already full but happy everything was nice and tasty they have a really interesting menu and um, the prices are good see you in the next video Assalamualaikum so you're driving in Jakarta? Of course, Jakarta, Bogor, I drove to uh, Bandung. Do you follow the rules? Um, you don't need to, there are no rules. You just, you know, if there's traffic, if I see a police officer, I'll just like, come in, take, pay him, and he'll let me just uh, skip the traffic. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's amazing to drive. It feels safe. Everyone's still conscious about what's going on. Is it same in Dhaka? Dhaka's worse. <laughs> mm. yeah, Dhaka's worse. Yeah. Yeah. Bangladesh, is, uh, the infrastructure is not there the way the Indonesia is. Uh, there is a river infrastructure. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> Everything goes on the boats. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. So there's no way they're in the region.